Hey guys, how's it going? This is Gerald Harris, founder and creator of Real Estate Investing Tips for Beginners. So today is going to be a little bit of a different video. Um, spring is here. Cars have the pollen and the yellow film and look yucky. And you have insects everywhere. <laughs> right? Whether that be carpenter bees, whether that be mosquitoes. You hear crickets outside. Um, we live on over an acre of land and it can get crazy around here, especially as we are in spring and even heading into the summer, right? So this is the thing. I did a video, I think about a little over a year ago, around a year ago, something like that. I was talking about box elder bugs and how I was using peppermint oil. For box elders so that has worked well that still continues to work however whether you have stink bugs some carpenter bees uh, mosquitoes outside the list goes on and on right the reason I'm bringing this up is this many of us you know we'll go to and I'm probably the most guilty go to Home Depot or I'll go to Amazon or some specialty store and I order poison to go ahead and kill all these bugs. Okay. <laughs> but at a certain point, when you're spraying so much poison around your property, and if you have uh, kids or you have pets, uh, that's not a good thing. And uh, this, even even if you don't have kids or pets, it's still not a good thing to be spraying so much toxicity around your property. So I'm going to ask you guys, this is what I've been doing. Pretty much going the natural route. It's actually been working really well. So peppermint oil. Let me tell you something. Get some peppermint oil. Some pure. Let me show you. It's right here. Now you guys can't see the 100% pure and natural peppermint oil. Natural Bliss peppermint oil, right? Anything that's pure, anything that's just 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 potent, extremely strong, right? Put that in a bottle. And fill that bottle up with warm water. Spray it around the house. Cool. You're gonna spray it around the house. It's gonna repel a lot of the bugs, a lot of the different things around the house. This is the key. Wait till it cools down at night, in evening and at night. Then go back around and spray it around the house. Just spray it once a week. Spray it. That scent will stick on, first of all, everything at night. It, tends to go to sleep, calm down, etc., etc. Some of your properties can be real crazy, right? In terms of activity and bugs around the house, etc., etc. So, when it's cool and it's calm at night, spray around the property. Utilize, I'm going to say, 10 to 15, even 20 drops of this. Because my house sits a little higher, um, I would actually encourage a lot of you, and I, I want to hit, I brought it right here. It is a, it's kind of like a, a commercial sprayer bottle. And I know I, <laughs> I just started looking into the spray bottles themselves probably about two or three months ago. This is the thing with the commercial spray bottles, what they do is they can spray up like, 15 20 feet 25 feet you know so if you got a property that's higher than normal some of you have your own property some of you have investment properties that there is some real problems with those properties right in terms of infects and infestation and that type of thing i would encourage a lot of you to at least try peppermint oil get you about 10 to 15 drops put it in a bottle Mix it with some warm or hot water. Spray around the daytime, but wait till everything calms down at night. Then walk around your property and spray it. 
you'll be a little surprised um, at what begins to happen. And what it does is it doesn't it doesn't kill them; it just repels them. You know, gets them away from the property and, and go to other places because, like I said, spraying all that poison. Um, I did it for years, but I didn't know. You know, you don't know what you don't know. And so what I would do is encourage a lot of you that are looking for a natural way to go ahead and deter these, these uh, pesky little insects and whatnot, use it. And, and I haven't tried it yet, but maybe some of you all can go ahead and use it like on your camping trips and stuff like that. You know what I mean? Outdoors, you all are fishing and doing different things, you know? But make sure that you use a good amount of peppermint oil. That scent, that smell that sticks around the property will stay there for a period of time. For me, it's been working. For me, it's been working well. Okay? So, if y'all found value in the video, please click the like button. Share it with family and friends once again. And uh, you all have a great... You know what? I'm going to... Um, in the description, I'm going to have some links. I have some links to where you all can go ahead and, and check these out. I'll link it to like a, a, a Amazon. And I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to link my old video too. So you all can go ahead and check it out. All right. You all have a great day. And I hope that helps someone out there. Okay. You all take care. Have a good one.